the cluster creates value by connecting people, basically people from different parts of the cluster, from the fisheries to the biologists. And these connections have made all kinds of new products that we believe will and have already been creating a significant value for the, the whole industry. I think that's the difference between the Icelandic fisheries and many others, is that we are taking the value chain more seriously. So we're moving into some of the nutraceutical and the pharmaceutical areas with our fisheries industry at this point. spin-off of the Iceland Ocean Cluster is a company called Cartland and Cartland is already developing products which I think will be world-class in terms of the processing of uh, restoral material from the fish. These new, this new technology using enzyme technology will manufacture fish oil and fish meal from restoral material which in most countries is thrown into the dustbin or into the sea. And we're talking about significant amounts here, around 500,000 tons of cod is thrown into the dustbin or into the sea only in the northern North Atlantic and the Barrett Sea region. So what the cluster basically is trying to do is to combine the global size companies with the small companies in, in Iceland and actually in the, in, the, in the North Atlantic region as well. Mm -hmm. I think that's going to be the, the measurement of our success, whether we are able to make this connection happen at a, at a global scale. And we believe we're in the, in the right position and at the right time to do that. We have at this point around 12 projects, over 60 companies within the cluster, but 12 projects that we think are all globally expandable at some levels. Most of these con concepts are obviously in the food technology sector, but we have also uh, very interesting projects regarding the technology itself, the processing talk technology, mm -hmm. which we believe can be expanded quite rapidly on a global scale but we have to realize this has to be done professionally, so we're not, not hurrying in any way, we're trying to do it as professionally as possible. I think in many ways we are a typical cluster management company, connecting people from different areas. But what we also felt that our, our members want us to do is to not only connect them but follow up on their ideas. There are many companies coming together to do some work. What they want us to do then is to follow up on the ideas, setting up the business plans and making their sort of projects work. 